Assalamu alaikum my dear students you are warmly welcome to my class hope you are fine I am also fine by the grace of the Almighty Allah and you are also welcome to class 9 after passing your junior secondary level you are now in secondary level that means you are the students of class 9 so you are welcome to class 9 according to our present exam system at the end of 9 and 10 you have to attend your SSC exam that means throughout the year 9 and 10 you will read out the same books and based on your study of these two uh, years books you have to appear in the SSC exam so my dear students now it's time to take a good preparation you have to increase your abilities you have to overcome the weakness of all the topics in all subjects and today i am here to help you out in english first paper and here i am welcoming muhammad ruhul amin assistant teacher english gcpsc the class has been designed for class 9 and the subject is English first paper. In your JSC syllabus, you learned only English one paper. That means there was no first paper and second paper variation. But in class 9, again, you have to study English first paper and second paper. And here, you will have 100 marks in English first paper and another 100 marks in English second paper. So today I am here to help you out to show you what is the mark distribution in your English first paper in class 9 and 10 as well as in SSC examination. So let's get started. So the name of our subject is English first paper. Here you will have a subject code based on the subject code your result will be published the subject code for english first paper is 107 your time for the exam will be three hours full marks 100 that means 100 marks for first paper and another 100 marks for second paper so there might be some curiosities what are the things that are getting increased uh, that are new in class 9 syllabus. For that, you have to do one of the things that you have to do. English first paper, Akshomark English second paper. So, you have to do one of the key items that you have to do in class 9. So, you have to do one of the key items that you have to do in class 9. Ask your mother in class 9. You have to do one of the key items that you have to do in class that means I'm Razani English first paper a due to item actor say reading test actor say writing test Re reading test to say to make a poor a poor a answer could have a writing what say to make a leak to have a that means I can do to a skill cast for me one is reading is still to my lack of for as a deep hollow high to my reading for as a deep hollow high to my vocabulary is done a follow take a talent to me follow leak to power writing what's a to my age take a job to my for us a author to me क्वेश्चन देखे वोटार ऊपर भेबे भेबे लिखते हैं एखे तुम्हार पढ़ार को सूझ नहीं हे पढ़े लिखते हैं अर्थात पढ़ार ऊपर निर्भर कर तुम्हार साफल्य रिडिंग टेस्ट तई तुम्हारा जेहतु बसर शुरूते आसो और तुम्हारे स्कूल कार्यक्रम जेहतु सरसर स्कूल कार्यक्रम किस बंध आज है तुम्हारे पढ़ाशनार्ज प्रचुर समय पाच से ही क्षेत्र में इट इज माई हाम्बल रिक्वेस्ट टू यू दैट यू मास्ट स्टाडी वाल द बुक्स स्पेशलि द सिलेबस अब क्लस नाइन that means from the beginning of all books you will study uh, by reading thoroughly or that me jore jore utcharan kore kore shundor kore porbe so that you can get the information in your memory jate kore tottho gulo tomar mathay chole ashe that means if you read well your writing will be well that's why you must read a lot especially english first paper uh, bangla first paper bgs इसलम शिक्षा अर्थात जगह रिडिंग पढ़ले विज्ञान जगह रिडिंग पढ़ले अनेक बोझा जाए यू नो नीड टू टेक द हेल्प अफ अदार्स यू कैन कन्साल्ट द डिक्शनारि फर इंगलिस एंड फर बांगला देर यूल फाइंड साम वाट बोकाबुलारि और शब्द अर्थ तुम देखते पा बर प्रत्येक गल्पर पर यह रिडिंग पढ़ाटा एनहान्स करो हमें प्रथम देखते रिडिंग टेस्ट 
in reading test we will uh, uh, read the text and answer questions 1 and 2 tar mane ekti passage thakbe sin passage from your eft book english for today book sei book theke dutu ekti passage thakbe sei passage er upor theke 1 and 2 number question answer korte hobe amra dekhi 1 number ki royeche yes this is common 1 number e royeche mcq ortho there will be 7 mcq and maximum mcq will be vocabulary based some will be information based ortho odikangsho uh, mcq gulo hoy hocche amader shobdo ortho meaning ki opposite meaning ki uh, the phrase mane ki ei phrase ta dara ki bujhiyeche all these things and uh, kichu kichu hocche information based ortho totthyo jante chay seta abar uh, tomake passage ta bhalo pora thakle shei totthyo gulo amra dite parbo so one number is quite common to you number 2 uh, number 2 is a uh, question answer yes there will be five questions five twos are ten that means past question a kind of passage based past question that we say question to look at them again sir like that I can attend marks so from the first passage uh, your marks are, are uh, ten and uh, se uh, seven that means 17 question number three another passage uh, the part of a passage will be given from your EFT book আরো একটি প্যাসেজ অথবা প্যাসেজের অংশ ইএফটি বুক থেকে এখানে 3 নম্বরে দেয়া থাকবে এবং এই প্যাসেজের সামারি এই প্যাসেজের সামারি দেয়া থাকবে এখানে ফিল ইন দা গ্যাপস আকারে देयर উইল বি 5 গ্যাপস এন্ড ইউ হ্যাভ টু ফিল ইন দা গ্যাপস অর্থাৎ এই পাঁচটি গ্যাপ তোমাকে পূরণ করতে হবে बेस्ड অন ইওর রিডিং অফ দা অ্যাভাব টেক্সট অর্থাৎ এর উপরে যে টেক্সটটি থাকবে যে প্যাসেজটি থাকবে সেটা পড়ে সেটার আলোকে তোমাকে এই ফিল ইন দা গ্যাপসটা পূরণ করতে হবে এখানে টেকচল শব্দ নিতে পারলে ভালো এখানে তোমাকে গ্রামারে সাউন্ড হতে হবে অর্থাৎ গ্রামারে তোমার ভালো দক্ষতা থাকতে হবে তাহলে এটা তুমি ভালো করে পারবা পাশাপাশি রিডিং পড়ে मीनिंग বোঝার দক্ষতা থাকতে হবে তাহলে এটা হচ্ছে 3 নাম্বার ইয়েস দিস ইজ কোয়াইট নিউ টু ইউ অর্থাৎ এটা একটা নতুন আইটেম যে আমাদের সিন প্যাসেজ পড়ে সেই প্যাসেজের সামারিতে ফিল ইন দা গ্যাপস করতে হয় এখানে 5 মার্কস then next another passage and this is uh, an unseen passage this is an unseen passage a unseen passage ti pore tomake answer korte hobe a four number and five number questions ei unseen passage ti je kono kichu hote theke hote pare ei unseen passage ti tomake porte hobe unseen passage ti pore tomar four number e jeta ashbe information transfer eta tumi khub tumra khub bhalo kore jano because you have already got this in class 8 information transfer ortat passage ti er upor bhitti kore ekhane information gulo pick korte hobe question number 5 this is very new for you this is very new for you in the sense that uh, this is a summary writing of the given passage or that product passage directly summary leak the hobby summary key i'm the zani summary one of the charm or move a mool kotha that a mool kotha a passage still mool kotha to make in your own words needs a show has a leak the hobby among uh, that uh, should be uh, one third of the given text. Or that they can is unseen passage to the attack. We should have at three things here. Beshi noy. It a come at the summary to make a lick of it. There is ten mark. Or that they can again to those mark. Roy said that a cool ballo grashik bomber in our further classes. We will get a uh, lesson on how to write summary. So this is a new topic for us. And this summary will be based on unseen passes. अतः दे अनसिन पैसेस्टी रूपर बेस्ड करे आमा के इस समारी टी लिखते होंगे। क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स अतः पैसेजर का शेष एक नोट से इंडिपेंडेंट क्वेश्चंस। मैस डी पार्ट्स ऑफ सेंटेंसेस इन कॉलम ए, बी एंड सी टू राइट फाइव कंप्लीट सेंटेंसेस। अतः आम्रा किंतु ये पूर्ण तो देखे शेषी कॉलम ए एंड बी थ এবার দেখতে পাচ্ছি কলাম এ বি সি অর্থাৎ তিনটা কলাম একটা সেন্টেন্সে তিনটা কলাম থাকবে তিনটা কলামে তিনটা অংশ থাকবে সেটা থেকে তোমাকে ফাইভ সেন্টেন্স ক্রিয়েট করতে হবে ইউ हैव टू ক্রিয়েট ফাইভ সেন্টেন্সেস টেকিং আপার্ট फ्रॉम ইচ অফ দা কলাম অর্থাৎ প্রত্যেক কলাম থেকে একটি করে নিয়ে তোমাকে পাঁচটি বাক্য গঠন করতে হবে দ্যাট मींस এটা একটা নিউ আইটেম এই অর্থে যে আমরা দুটো কলামে অবস্থিত ছিলাম আর নাও देयर আর থ্রি কলামস এখন হচ্ছে কলামস হচ্ছে তিনটি তাহলে আমাদের এটাও খুব বেশি প্র্যাকটিস করতে হবে এটা আসলে গ্রামাটিক্যাল কোনো টার্মস নয় তোমার এখানে যদি পড়ার দক্ষতা ভালো থাকে তুমি যদি বারবার পড়তে পারো বা রিডিং পড়ার হ্যাবিট থাকে তাহলে তুমি এখানে সফল হবে এই অর্থে যে কোন বাক্যের মধ্যে কন্টার পরে কি হবে এটা অটোমেটিক তোমার রিডিং পড়ার অ্যাবিলিটি ভালো থাকলে मीनिंग ভালো বুঝতে পারলে চলে আসে কারণ একটি বাক্য কোথায় ভুল আছে এটা আমরা বুঝতে পারি এইভাবে আমাদের এক্সপেরিয়েন্স থেকে আমাদের আর্লিয়ার রিডিং থেকে অর্থাৎ বারবার রিডিং পড়লে আমরা বাক্যের প্যাটার্ন ধরতে পারি যে এরপরে এরকম হওয়া উচিত क्वेश्चन नंबर 
7 yes there will be 8 marks and this is quite uh, uh, new to you uh, uh, known to you uh, it is known because uh, you had uh, this in class 6 and 7 uh, in class 8 you didn't have this or the class 8 to mother it is still on the class uh, 6 7 is still a rearrange but this is important in the sense that in 6 and 7 there was only 5 marks for rearrange but now you have 8 marks for 8 sentences or the second bakko thakbe atti ebong atti ke sajanor jonno tomake 8 marks deya hobe ekhane atti bakko deya thakbe sei bakko gulote you know the rules of writing rearrange rearrange janar jonno oi je ami bollam ei khetreo tomake reading er kono alternatives nei there is no alternative to reading uh, if you want to do better in rearrange or the rearrange tokhoni korte parba jokhon tomar porar dokkhota beshi thakbe so you have to read a lot and many a time it is found that rearrange this story is common from your EFT book. Or that, odikangsh shomai dekha zai rearrange ti toma der EFT boi theke common ashi. Or that you have to read your EFT book a lot. Or that toma der English for two days or shob musto passes, boro passes, soro passes, shob gul passes. Shom porke toma dharon arakta. If you uh, can have a sound knowledge on reading of the passages, then it will be helpful for you to do better in rearrange also. Or that rearrange matching agulor khetre hoyta onik beshi helpful hoy. So if it is common, then you will have the confidence that you are getting it. Now, writing part. That means we have already completed our reading part. Now it is time for writing part. But you will be astonished to know that we have already completed the part for doing uh, 50 marks. That means the reading part consists of uh, 50 marks and writing test this also. Uh, has 50 marks. How? Let us see. Write a paragraph on a moonlit. Uh, that means at first uh, eight number there will be a paragraph writing. Yes, it is common because we have written paragraph. So write a paragraph on a moonlit night answering the following questions. That means there will be several questions and based on the questions you have to write a paragraph. You have to generate a paragraph. You have to produce a paragraph. So this is writing test. You have to write a paragraph and there will be 10 marks. Then completing story, but with 10 new sentences, that means you are not allowed to write more than 10 sentences. That means you will complete the story with uh, within 10 sentences and so that here is a trick, you should write the sentences, complex sentence, compound sentence or using linkers or connectors, using linkers or connectors so that uh, your sentence becomes large so that you can write within 10 new sentences because in class 9 you will have sound knowledge on simple complex and compound sentence you will also have sound knowledge on a new grammatical item that is use of connectors or joining words that's why it is very important to apply these connectors as well as simple complex and compound sentences while writing the completing story. Question number 10. This is absolutely new for you. Why? Yes, it is new in the sense that it is new in the sense that uh, there will be there will be a question. There will be a question that is called graph and chart. There will be a question that is called graph and chart. Okay, what will be in graph and chart? Uh, yes, in graph and chart, there will be a picture. There will be a picture or diagram and based on the picture or diagram, you are to write uh, the information what are given in the diagram. You have to highlight and summarize the information given in the chart or graph. That means, je chitro ti daya thakbe, she chitre je information gulo daya ase, she information gulo ke highlight kore, tumak ekti paragraph style e, ekti tatho chitro ke borno na korte hobe, tatho chitro borno na likhte hobe, tumak e, paragraph style e, evang jetar modde thakbe, ekhan kar information gulo. Arthat kuno chitro dekhe, she chitro diye, tumar kuno ekti abishoy ke, she kane tatho upatto daya thakbe, she ra ke tule anto hobe, she ra as, Summarize question door kore likhte hobe. Eta ke bolai graph and chart. Yes. In your uh, further classes, you will have sound discussion on 
a graft and child so keep following our online classes yes question number 11 uh, there will be an informal later so this is also quite known to you because in class 6 and 7 you had this uh, informal later yes here the sense is that you should not write the silly words silly sentences in your writing now you are a student of class 9 and 10 so it will be helpful for you if you if you write good sentences or uh, uh, new words based sentences so you have to use some artistic expression or uh, unusual expression so that uh, your uh, writing might be catchy then question number question number 12 this is the last question and that is a dialogue that means you have to draft a dialogue you have to draft a dialogue this is also very known to you so there you will also have 10 marks so there are five items for writing uh, first one is paragraph then completing story then graph and chart then informal letter and finally dialogue so uh, only question number 10 this is a uh, very new to you because you don't have this experience of writing graphs and chart so question number 10 is new uh, then uh, question number 5 is quite new uh, and question number 3 we will also tell that this is also new so only three items are no, uh, very new to you so uh, if you practice a lot these three items uh, you will get first classes on these three items so that you can uh, uh, you can feel that yes you know all the items all the items are very much known to you you have a sound experience of practicing this all the items that are for english first paper so uh, now it's time to say you goodbye inshallah we will discuss the important or unknown topics in our next video class keep watching this video to enhance your english abilities and do better in your exam as well as in your life keep fine khuda hafiz